breakaway jam. Well, they won't be down for long if they can get some more early offense just like that. Well, that's the best way to get that early offense, Clark. As soon as you come up with a steal, just sprint the other direction. Kobe with it. He's picked up by Parker. They double-team Kobe beyond the arc. It's hauled in by Dia Anderson. He's checked in for Parker. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. Here's Bellinelli, defended by Bryant. Bryant comes with the double team. For San Antonio, they have shot five of eight from the foul line. That free throw, no good. Boy, oh, it's terribly frustrating for a coach when his team can't knock down their free throw. I mean, it really comes down to focus, routine, and stamina, especially in the second half. What's up a three? And Baines pulls it down. And here's Anderson. Here's Joseph. And they're unable to get the tying basket there. And that one falls for Bryant. Finally, he's starting to convert after working his way to the line time and time again. We'll see if he can maintain the pace. He did the important part at the line there, the heavy lifting, if you will. And a moment here to look back at our State Farm assist of the game. Well, no question, this was going to be the winner. Just take a look at the expertise he shows on this pass. Perfectly timed and beautifully placed. On the floor for San Antonio, starting the fourth quarter. They've got Anderson. Corey Joseph is out there with Green. Then it's Aaron Baines, and it's Diaw in a power forward. And Green slams it in. Right back to the basics there, using the one-hand slam for that one. Doesn't he make the basics look pretty exceptional? Yeah, he does. They look sweet when he does it. Well, he should stay with those basics in a tight ball game because we've got one here tonight. Offensive rebound. Outside Bryant. Here's the three. From deep. They get it back. Shaq kicks to Bryant. Let's it go from deep. Los Angeles with another miss. He's been wayward and just off on about everything he's put up in this period. Here's Joseph. Back to Anderson. There's the feed to Baines. And it's sent back by Bryant. And here we go again. The Lakers on the break. And the dunk to finish it off. Oh, beauty. He is an automatic finisher when he gets into that area. You know, he picks the simple one-handed stuff to get the two points. Well, those could be an important two points, too, guys, in a close game like this one. Free throw good, Joseph. And checking out the game for Joseph. He's got eight points, and four of his points have come at the foul line. He's made the most of those opportunities. Which can't be undervalued, Clark. So many times the games can come down to which team wins the free throw battle. Splitters checked in for the Spurs. Duncan comes in for Boris Dia. San Antonio making a switch here. Parker's checked in. And let's get this update now from Doris Burke, who's across the way on the sideline. Hey, Kevin, during that last break, I heard the Lakers coach as he addressed his team. He tried to really fire them up to bring it home, saying, all night, you have all night to rest after the final buzzer. For now, we have to lay it on the line and try to bring it home. Guys, back to you. And here's Bryant for three. O'Neal gets to Kobe. From outside the arc. Shaq fishing to Bryant. Now split it. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Parker. Parker's got his seventh assist in the game. And a moment here to take a look at some hustle stats for the Spurs. Their high-energy defensive effort has paid off for them, guys, with more than a few steals over the course of the ballgame. The other thing they're doing, guys, is forcing turnovers and then creating points offensively as a result. After fighting back into it, they had a chance to tie this thing up. Steve, I love it. They are not going to... Oh, look out! Look out. Oh, 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 oh. Man, he got fancy with that one, didn't he? Yeah, maybe try to give them the momentum boost they need to break this game open. Yeah, I like that. Some coaches might want to see just a, a sure-handed lay-in, but 
I'd say put as much as you can on the finish and get your teammates going. Ano Ginobili's checked in for San Antonio. Now Parker puts up the baby hook. Easy call there. No question about that one. You can hear the impact from where I am. That's good from Parker. And Parker drops them both. Well, he's been having a tough game from the line, but that's more what we're used to seeing from him. For three, Kobe. And Splitter pulls it down. Splitter's got four rebounds in this game. This quarter has not been his best. The defense may be starting to affect him a little bit. There's Parker with the three. Once again off the mark by San Antonio. The Lakers trail. Outside, Kobe. That drops. Oh, Big time God. bucket inside. He had to get that one over the top, and he did. And in the face of a defender who was towering over him, too. It's Ginobili with the drive. They kick it out to Green. Goes back up. And there's the play inside by Duncan. And the Spurs lead by two. Guys, he's actually indefatigable. He never gives in, never gives up on a play. And that's what it takes to be a great offensive rebounder. You've got to be relentless. And Kobe Bryant again. Bryant's got it all tied up now for Los Angeles. Unbelievable basket. What a huge height disadvantage. I thought for sure it would be blocked. Not this fella, Steve. Not at this stage of the game. He was going to get to the rim no matter who was standing in the way. You know, something that's kept this game close is the fact that the rebound totals are, are almost identical. No separation there. Not yet, anyway. And there's a nice one-handed slam. Guys, this game's tied up primarily because of him. I mean, who knows where they'd be without his points today. And out of bounds as Los Angeles gains possession. Got sloppy in a close game. You have to take advantage of every opportunity. Anderson, he's checked in for Mono Genova. And here is Los Angeles now. They've led by as much as 10. That's the first that gives them the lead. So he gets them both, and it's a two-point ball game. Now you just knew he wasn't going to miss there, not with so much riding on him. It's tipped, and that's out of bounds. San Antonio will retain possession. Boy, that pass was in the air a long time. Long enough for him to get a finger on it anyway and send it out of bounds. Splitter misses. Jones with it. Knocks it loose. And they're pushing it up for the finish. The offensive rebound. Splitter. That one rolling around and runs out. I think it's going to be tough for them to trim this deficit if he keeps missing those kinds of shots, Kevin. I mean, they need his points. Here's Anderson. The shot is off. Good D by Jones. Kobe attacking. Fades and shoots. And Jones gets it to go in on the assist by Bryant. Fantastic pass. He turned that one into a pretty easy basket for his teammate. Duncan, the pass to Split. So he gets the whistle. Contact on the way up and two shots coming up. He doesn't hit the first, and that was the one they really want. He's got one more, though. And the second of two is good. That narrows the lead down to just three. He got them to within one possession, but that one miss puts a lot of pressure on them at the defensive end. It's Parker with the drop. Sinks it, and that shot brings them to within just one. And you can see it in his eyes right now. Parker is going for the juggler. Bryant, that's for two. It's stolen by Duncan. Here's Green. Second shot opportunity. And the whistle goes. It'll be on Tiago Split. That's his third power so far. When the situation in effect, so we'll head to the free throw line for two. Can't sink it. And that was an important free throw. Well, they're still within reach, but they need a hoop pretty much every time down the floor. Well, they've got a little light, but they better execute every time. Ooh, a pressure basket right there. Now that's coming through in the clutch. 
Green against Bryant. Poked away. And a fast break now for the Spurs. Green with the ball to win the game. Oh, it's no good. And what? And what great competition we're seeing so far. After four quarters, a stalemate. And we'll see now how these two teams and these few minutes of basketball pan out. So the Lakers win the tip. And so they have the first opportunity on offense right here as we begin overtime. Courtesy of Gatorade. All fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset the lineup for us now in overtime. Taking a look at Los Angeles. Jones is out there with Ori. Then there's Shaquille O'Neal. Then there's Derek Fisher, and it's Bryant in at the two spot. And the foul called on Daniel Green. Here is Bryant. San Antonio with the rebound. Anderson's got three rebounds so far in the game. So they take the lead. And turnovers, Clark and Steve, have been the issue for him. Yeah, it sure has been the case. I mean, turnovers are like missing breakfast. Eventually, it's going to cost you. <laughs> <laughs> Why does it always come back to food, Clark? <laughs> <laughs> These are incredible rebounding numbers. I'm not sure if we've ever seen anything like this, Clark. Oh, that's for sure, Steve. I mean, a superhuman performance on the backboard. Well done. What a smooth finish. Well, he's certainly the one they want on the end of those breaks. He always finishes strong. Bryant against Green. The drive by Bryant. Six to shoot. Jones kicks to Bryant. Lets it go with a three. And that one's good. Kobe's got five points in the court. D there, guys, was pretty much non-existent. I mean, you can't leave a good shooter like that open. Parker kicks to Green. A little over a minute and a half gone now here in overtime. Off target at the rim. Outside Bryant. From deep. San Antonio with the rebound. Parker's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Anderson dishes the splitter. Cannot hit. Good D by Jones. I like the work there. Contesting that shot that looked like it was going to be easy, but they forced the miss. You know what? He got it in close, but couldn't finish in traffic. Here's the dish to O'Neal. Knocked away! And now the fast break. Anderson with the ball. Connects! And that shot sucked the life out of the whole building. Well, that was a big one, Clark. You could hear it. Yeah, that was a gut punch right there. These fans, oh, man, they're struggling. And here's Bryant for three. Just under two and a half minutes passed here in this overtime. And he's way off from outside. He hasn't been much help to them offensively here in overtime, Kevin. Maybe he's just exhausted. And yes, sir, that one drops. Took advantage of some shoddy defense there. They've got to at least get a finger on it. Not much time to work with. They need a basket here. Yep, they've got to get a steal or foul to stop the clock. And that's an intentional foul. And an intentional foul right there. Gets the first, that increases their lead to six. And so he drops them both. It's a seven-point game. Well done at the free throw line. I'll tell you what, that will make things a lot easier on them if they can continue to convert. And a clear foul there as he shot the triple. He'll go to the line for three free throws. He makes the first of three, and that trims the lead to six. A different look now for San Antonio. He makes the second free throw, and that brings them within five. And so he's good in all three free throws, and that shrinks the margin to just four. It's stolen by Bryant. The layup missed. From the length of the floor. Oh, oh, how did that go in? Unbelievable. 